The Lord be with you. I'm Deacon Keith Fournier, and our first reading is taken from the book of Sirach. The Lord fashioned human beings from the earth to consign them back to it. He gave them so many days and so much time. He gave them authority over everything on earth. He clothed them in strength like himself and made them in his own image. He filled all living things with dread of human beings, making them masters over beasts and birds. He made them a tongue, eyes and ears, and gave them a heart to think with. He filled them with knowledge and intelligence and showed them what was good and what was evil. He put his own light in their hearts to show them the magnificence of his works so that they would praise his holy name as they told of his magnificent works. He set knowledge before them. He endowed them with the law of life. He established an eternal covenant with them and revealed his judgments to them. Their eyes saw the majesty of his glory and their ears heard the glory of his voice. He said to them, beware of all wrongdoing. He gave each a commandment concerning his neighbor. Their ways are always under his eye. They cannot be hidden from his sight. And our response is taken from Psalm 103. As tenderly as a father treats his children, so Yahweh treats those who fear him. He knows of what we are made. He remembers that we are dust. As for a human person, his days are like grass. He blooms like the wildflowers. As soon as the wind blows, he's gone, never to be seen there again. But Yahweh's faithful love for those who fear him is from eternity and forever. And his saving justice to their children's children, as long as they keep his covenant and carefully obey his precepts. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Mark. People were bringing little children to Jesus for him to touch them. The disciples scolded them, but when Jesus saw this, he was indignant and said to them, let the little children come to me, do not stop them. For it is to such as these that the kingdom of God belongs. In truth, I tell you, anyone who does not welcome the kingdom of God like a little child will never enter it. Then he embraced them, laid his hands on them, and gave them his blessing. The Gospel of the Lord.